something. That is ink. Because I don't even know if we've shown them, Kate. Go get your shirt. Good morning. It is Monday, guys. It's our last week home before we go on vacation, and I am more than excited. I am so ready from a break from reality <laughs> and be able to relax and not think of anything else other than just being with family and having fun. But before we can do any of that stuff, I have to take Tom his wallet because forgot his wallet. I have to go to the hair store, I have to go to the post office, and we have the whole week to prepare and get all of the stuff done that we need to get done. How's your week going so far? I know it just began, but I hope it's starting great. All right, wallet check, post office check, now hair store, then home. Well, a little time has gone past, but I got those other errands that I needed to get done, done. And this was what I ended up getting today. I had such a hard time. I know most of you like this will mean absolutely nothing to you, nothing to you, but being a hairstylist, I was trained with a Marcel curling iron, which is a curling iron that looks like this. I will show you. So it does not have a normal handle, all right? It doesn't have a handle like this, which is what, you know, just most people use on a daily basis. I was trained with this, so it's a little bit more complicated and you have nothing on the end. There's no tip, which I don't know if there's a tip on here. I think there is. Anyway, I was going to get another Marcel, but I kind of decided not to only because I've had Marcel's for like 10 years. They're great curling irons, but I kind of wanted to try something different and I wanted a titanium. Those are not titanium. And I wanted titanium because it is less damaging to your hair. So, I know quite a few people that use these ones and I thought I would try this and see how it works. I had to get a new curling iron because mine are just old and breaking and it was time. Then I got some travel hairspray, some travel dry shampoo, some travel heat protectant, just a bunch of travel sized items so that I don't have to bring all my big stuff which is what I normally do. Anyway, I wanted to show you guys my cool curling iron. I'm pretty excited to try it out. And it's fun because my hair being shorter, it takes me like five minutes to curl it, so I can curl it more often and actually like have my hair down. But for today it's that because it's a workout day. Most days that I work out, my hair is just gonna be up in a ponytail because it's just way easier. Anyway, I am making dinner now. We're having pork chops and mashed potatoes. And I've just been working on laundry. Oh, I don't know what that is, but I have something. That is ink. Because I don't even know if we've shown them, Kate. Go get your shirt. Who is this? This is what Katie and I have been working on the last couple days. I'm pretty sure that's what's all over my hand, is her shirt. But. This is part of her little costume for her Living History Museum Day. I'm pretty excited. Katie and I, we did that all on our own and she actually personalized it and put her friend's names in her class instead of just the girls and people that um, Taylor Swift has on her. So I think it's kind of cool. I don't know if I showed you guys, but I finally got my Kayla rings. And I'm just getting used to them because these ones are a lot tighter than my other ones. So I'm having to stretch these out and see them. They are fitting a lot better today than they did on Saturday. So I just have to get used to them. I'm, I'm not used to having something so constricting around my finger anymore since I got my new wedding rings and whatnot. But I really do like them. They're super cute. I love the stackable. So they're three separate rings, if you can tell, like that. 
and you just kind of stack them in whichever way you want. So they're really cute. It just took a while for me to get them because Kalo is like switching their whole system, I guess. So their shipping stuff was taking a lot longer than normal. But I have them now and I'm very happy with them other than them being a little tight. I just wanted to tell you guys, my hair still fits into a braid. I don't know how long you can see that. But it's in a French braid. What? Please. You want to watch Puppy? Yeah. Okay, let me have the phone. Sweet. Now I'll turn Puppy on. Can you say hi? I don't think you said hi to our friends today. Can you say hi to our friends? Hi, friends. <laughs> did you have a good day? It's your arm. It, yeah? Did you, have, did you have a good day, buddy? Yes, I played with all eggs. You played with eggs? Yes. You did? Yeah, yeah did I you did. did you play outside? Yes, yes. Yes. Did you do sprints with mama? Yes. Yes. Good morning. What do you want to watch? I want this puppy. Puppy. This one. This one? Yeah. Alright. Bunnies? Didn't you already have bunnies? Oh, here's your bunnies. See? There they are. Say thank you. Thank you. Tom brought home macaroons today. These are wheat free, gluten free, dairy free, yeast free, yeast, yeast free, sulfite free, soy free, and lactose free. And they're made in a peanut free facility. So he got these at National Grocer and he said that like they're they're pretty good. I mean, they've got sugar, obviously, but besides that, he said the ingredients are pretty good. He said they taste good, so I'm gonna give it a try. They're really good. It tastes like. It tastes like a macaroon. Yeah, it tastes like a regular macaroon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're really good. Do you guys like macaroons? A coconut. Or should I do like coconut macaroons? Yeah, those are really good. I wasn't expecting them to come in a canister, though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, anyway, this is a brand. They're Jenny's. Never heard of them, but... Yeah. So, if you have a natural grocer or Whole Foods or something, these are really good if you like coconut macaroons and want to find something that doesn't have all the yucky crap in it. Well, everyone, it is time for bed. It is late. I am tired. I can't tell you. I am so burned out from work <laughs> like even before I got ready for work this morning i was just like i don't want to go <sighs> luckily next week is when we when i start go on leave go on vacation hopefully that'll reset everything and i won't feel as as burned out but i, I need a break so I'm praying hoping i got one week left one week one week to go with that i'll leave you guys Make sure you like and subscribe, please. And we will see you in the morning. Good night.